Good evening. Tonight we're embarking on a journey deep underground in the mythical cave here in Qingdao. This was once a famous tourist attraction back in the 1990s, showcasing the mythical fairy tales of Chinese culture with over 300 characters in the caves. However, in 1995, due to the rapid development of tourism within the city, the numbers of visitors fell from thousands to hundreds to eventually none. For years, the cave lay dormant with rumored investments to revive it falling on deaf ears. The cave was finally demolished in 2009, never to be seen again. The mythical caves have been forgotten, untouched, abandoned until tonight. I'm joined by, from the last video, Hua Man, the silent explorer. As you may know from the last video, he's actually deaf. So, so far we've been communicating via phone. However, once we go down there, we're gonna have no signal and we won't be able to communicate. It's extremely dangerous and no one's gonna be able to find us till the next morning if anything goes wrong. Let's begin. <laughs> Oh man, let's go, let's go. Hi guys, so we're gonna go down in this underground car park. This is kind of where we are. Do you? Yeah, right here. Okay, this is where we are right now. And uh, let's go through here. This is the last time we'll see any life until we go back up. Let's go. Oh man, hi guys. This is extremely dangerous, as I was saying before. If any of us get injured, or even our torches turn off, we're gonna be in big trouble. Even though it's quite echoey, we're going deep underground. Meters and meters underground. Just started. The water's already rising. And just all this rubbish. <coughs> Fuck me, guys. <coughs> you okay? Oh, you can't hear me. I feel like I've been talking to myself, which I am, because. You can't hear me. Fuck me. It's the right puddle. Ah, look at all that. Damn. Okay. I think he never gets scared because he can't hear anything. So, like, if we ever hear any sounds, I feel like uh, <laughs> I'm the only one who hears it. But it's super echoey in here. So any, like, pin drop, I'll hear it, but he won't. <laughs> I feel like he must be less scared. Whoa, look at this. Old drawings left on the wall. Some guys smoking cigarettes. Fucking hell. Through here? What's in here? So yeah, we just have to rely on pointing to each other. What's he looking at? Pointing over here. Where's he gone? There he is. But uh, look at who a man's torch. That's what is uh, notorious for. Mine. Oh, shit. <laughs> so we're just in this like an underground tunnel. As you saw in the last video, Qingdao has lots of war tunnels that were built in case of any nuclear attacks. These are like air defense bases that are left underground, these, left under these car parts. And look at these huge doors that can block any, anything that happens. Step over this. So you just got loads of rubble left behind but we're going to be entering trying to find the mythical cave supposedly some creatures some characters are left behind some models so we're going to see what was once there i'm going to do this video quite raw because uh yeah i don't know i don't know who else will do a video like this or come here ever again Go in, they go in. Oh dear, there's like a swimming pool down there. Where's he taking me? Yeah, that's 
footsteps. Oh. Okay. Super creepy, eh? All you can hear is water trickling and dripping off the top of the cave. Oh, fuck it out. Look at that. It's drops of water. Pool. Risking my life, guys, late at night, going in these caves. What it would take is to wrong footing on here, bang your head against a rock or something, and that'd be it. So we're just taking us for a tunnel. Need to go this way. Oh, you go down there. Oh, where do you want to go? I'll lead the way here, man. Silent Explorer. So yeah, as you can see, there's no way for us to kind of talk. And yeah, he's he's mute as well, so we can't actually communicate. But he's a nice guy, man, showing us around for part two of our adventures. In these caves. Wow, look at that! Wow. Just holes and tunnels dug out in here. Bloody hell! Keep going. Sandbags here. Don't know what these are for. It's been left here. Some of the rubbish. Got a tunnel here. What's it? No, no. Have a look. Okay. Who man wants to check out this entrance here? You could be here all night going through all the little doors you'll find through these tunnels. Without, especially without any kind of... Oh, fuck. Fuck's sake. What was that? Shit. Oh, shit. Whoa, look at this. Are we going up there? Fuck it out. Look at all those steps. Jesus Christ, must be like a thousand. No? fucking dust. Sometimes when he's heavy footed he makes like really loud no <laughs> loud footsteps. There's a spade there. If you find anyone who wants to attack us. Got some weapons. It's so dusty down here. All the soot just falling from the walls as you're walking. I wonder where those stairs lead to. Oh, look at all that fucking rubbish. Left on the ground. Whoa, shit. Fucking hell, what we found? Who lives here? No way. Hi right, guys, we found an abandoned room. There's a computer left here. Someone's lunch. Look how old this fucking lunch box must be. It's even metal. Are these like war rations or something? And this old Lenovo computer. Fuck me. He's just laughing. And look, even someone left some spicy sauce unopened. Fuck me. Chinese tea with an espresso cup. Better not touch it. But he left his glow stick here. Maybe he was one. What's really. What do you think, who man? You good? <coughs> Take a picture. Man, how why is this computer here? Imagine what's on it if you took it apart. 
probably some naughty pictures or something hidden on that computer. <laughs> ah, what the hell? He left his boots here as well. Maybe we're not alone. And if we do see someone, God knows what we'll do. Because who a man can't speak, and we now have no phone signal, especially in this cave. Mm. Hopefully we don't meet any anyone down here. Oh. No, dead end. Someone's blanket down up here. It's got some fake bananas. It's handy. Maybe we can maybe we can drop some bananas on the floor so we can find our way back. So everything looks the same right now. God knows how we'll find our way back. But just me and her man walking into the darkness of the tunnel. Look at all this paint that's been left here. So we should walk in. Someone left this tissue here. Someone's either been blowing their nose or wanking all evening in this tunnel. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> That's where you find pots of tissues and bricks. You hear that water just flowing from the side of the path. That's what you can hear here. So it's just sewage or something, throw some dirty water. Oh man, so it's compass. I think he knows the coordinates. So yeah, he's not messing around. He's got the compass to know where he's going. Okay, and here's more water flowing. That's him stronger. What should we do? Go straight, all right? Okay, heading to the noise. It doesn't smell too bad. But yeah, this water is like sewage water, I'm guessing. See why you told us to get the rain boots now. We're gonna go up these steps. Fucking hell. We're going up here? It says let's go. Wow, look at these steps. Yeah. It's a long path to nowhere. I think we found a football. Is it? I think it's a. Oh, it's a... Hey. Oh, <laughs> oh, cool, guys. Let's go. Shit at the moment, I'm guessing. I hope this is mud and not shit. I really hope it is, it's so fucking sludgy. I feel like I'm gonna be sick. Well, I made it up to university. Okay. Basketball here. Right, it's feeling a bit cold now. I think we're outside somewhere. Oh, right University, Qingdao Sports Development Centre. Okay. Oh, we're in the university. Right, there's a mattress. You see the ground upstairs? Christmas decoration. Are we in a school? Okay. A 
That's why we saw footballs earlier. Got hurdles. Look at this trophy. Shot puts and stuff. Got a fucking javelin. that if we find any creatures creatures in there so that gets us back out into the street I don't know if you can see that but yeah through these doors is the rest of the street <coughs> let's go all right no mythical cave yet but we found university sports cupboard This door leads to this door leads to more of the tunnel. So far, we're really just walking into darkness. And it just stretches for miles and miles. Who really knows where we're going to end up? But yeah, if you're new here, guys. Thanks for joining. Fuck, here's some dogs. There's a tent, there's a dog. Bye bye. Dog. some dogs. just outside. Man, I thought there's some dogs tied up down there. God knows where we are on the map now, but that tunnel partly led outside there. And um, I think there was just some dogs tied up next to someone's apartment or guard dogs to this tunnel. Who knows? Must be deep. Wow, look at this. Abandoned swimming pool. It must be a swimming pool, right? Look at the shape. Why is this here? Maybe they're preparing for people to live in these tunnels. This would have been the only they even have a ladder. That is 
that's fucking weird. Abandoned swimming pool. Would have been a nice swimming pool in here as well. It's nice and warm. Should we go for a swim? <laughs> Me and who are man? Wow, so far, I've seen a lot of random stuff on my journey. So that's what I meant, guys. Always have to be checking left and right. You never know when this silent tunnel can take an unexpected turn. There's markings on the wall. There's all blocked off. Oh, is this a prison? How can the doors not shut? Oh, fuck me. <laughs> it's fine. <laughs> ah. <laughs> That's the only sound it makes. But look at these doors, they look like prison doors. What's the room? Maybe they're just like really heavy doors. the way the doors are slightly open as well. I feel like someone's gonna peek their head through the hole or peek around the corner. Man, it's so creepy. Why are they left open like that? So this is just like one one big circle. You open one door and you can like walk around. Yeah, they're all connected. We're past the dogs. We know we're not gonna get bit and alive. Let's continue. Let's see what we'll all find. Look at the mud, it's absolutely sludgy now. Markings on the wall. Okay. Oh, luckily. Oh my god, shit. It's so sticky. What is that? Oh man. This area is so sludgy. I feel like I can fall so easily. Alright, let me keep now where I'm going because uh, I did not want to fall flat in my ass. There's a sign here. If you ever feel claustrophobic, this is not the place to come. Because the tunnel is starting to get a bit narrower. And my heads are nearly touching the ceiling. But these tunnels here in Qingdao, they were the biggest kind of air defense project. One of the first ever in China back in the 1980s. You just get an idea how big it was. Afraid that, or preparing just in case there was ever an airstrike or yeah, a nuclear bomb during the time of the Cold War back in the 80s. And this tunnel. Fuck me, let me know. Okay. This is much more spacious. But really dusty, I can see it in the light. Fucking hell, bro. You can see this, I don't know if you can see it on the camera, but the fucking soot is just. in the. the soot is just in the air. And just in front of us are barrels. What's all this? Left here, barrels of what? These are like empty. 
no bats in these caves. They're just completely empty. These abandoned houses and rooms in this cave, Christmas tree, or something. Mm. Oh, fuck me. That's super creepy. Oh, man. Check this out. Fuck me. Oh, our first mythical creature we've seen. You haven't got a wig still on. Jesus Christ. Guys, what the hell? Look at this. Look at all these pictures on the walls. This was a, a big tourist attraction back in the 90s. And people would come down here to see these mythical statues. And it kind of tells a story. I think this is a, like Chinese New Year. The pig, the horse, how they cross in the river, the monkey. So, the zodiac story. Do you want to go here? Okay, I think before checking it out, let's show the stairs. Oh, okay, right. So this was the entrance. Let's have a look. Like dragons on the wall. Look at that. All these mythical creatures, I know. I'm sure Hua Man knows all about their stories. But yeah, look at these paintings still left here. The women, the dragons, the elephants, the elephant god, the wizards, look at him with his sword. And the entrance has been boarded up. This was, this was demolished back in 2009, but they left the remains some of the artwork. Let's see. They completely boarded in. That's why me and Herman had to take up this route. Yeah. This has been a the sign. Wow. I think that's a you know who. entrance to the to the myth cave. Posters lying down, bricks everywhere. So let's begin. Let's go. Let's go. Let's see what remains through these huge doors abandoned, forgotten, unseen years and years, decades, and I can already see the first statues and they are fucking creepy. Oh my god, that is the creepiest thing. Oh man, oh man, that is so scary. That is so scary. Oh man, I'm so scared. Okay, who a man's walking slowly, I've noticed. Oh, it's a huge fucking Buddha. Count how many people there are. If any move, once I turn the camera away to this Buddha, I'm going to shit my pants. I think Huaman's even a little scared. I notice he's like walking much slower than before. And this is uh, the Buddha. He bowed down here and three times. Let's get a closer look. I've watched enough horror movies. Do not take anything from these kind of places, especially something like that flower pot. The cave will start to move in. Okay, we're going inside the Buddha. Yeah. We're in the big Buddha. Let's 
So if you can read Chinese, that's what uh, that Buddha's name is, I think. Jesus, let's have a look. This is so creepy. creepy. I think they're made out of like paper mashing or something. <laughs> oh man, so heavy footed. <laughs> He's making... Oh man. There's even more characters in here. Apparently there's around 300. I hope none of them move. Gangster, you walk straight over that. Oh, let's check this out. Let's go back. Okay, we found some more people. Wow, look at this. Oh my god, it's so scary. He's got four eyed monster stars. Look at this one. Of uh, someone you'd have to, I don't know, it looks like they're looking down on you, so you'd have to kneel. And this would be the typical costumes I'd wear these silk robes. Ah, oh, man, you can still see the kind of look on their faces. Oh, man. I feel like they're going to move at any second. <laughs> <It's> like, ah! <laughs> symbolizes a drunk man. Oh, this one has no hand. His hands come off. Jesus Christ. This one over here tells the story of a baby. Something's falling on the floor. Seems like this lady wants to take her baby away. Got two kids. I guess it would have moved on this little ladder, going up and down on, like a machine. It seems like she wants this crazy coat for sale. Don't know why it has red eyes. Oh man. <laughs> okay. No man's a gangster, doesn't care. Unfazed. Alright, let's keep going. His faces are super creepy. I'm gonna have nightmares for sure. Ah, oh, look at his kids, fucking head blown off. His head's been, he's fallen down. Someone must have pushed him. Ah, oh, look at this scary one. Jesus, killed a turtle. Slayed him with his scary teeth. Big blue man. Jesus Christ, fucking head's fallen off. That weak. Looks like this man's cast a spell on this one. Slayed him. Oh, this woman looks super creepy. Her eyes seem like they have so much emotion. Fuck me. It's like the woman has slayed a man. Oh my god. Look at that. Headless figures. This one's hands are peeling off. You can see how they're made. They're actually a metal clothes on. Water's starting to drip off the ceilings here. Found 
this big tomb. Let's go by it. Is her water dropping? Jesus Christ. Look at this little tomb. This would have been a god laid here. Look at his head. <laughs> god knows what it was. Look at that. Oh man. All this stuff is left for a left underground, just rubble. See what else lies in this tunnel. I could never do this alone. Imagine coming here by yourself. Even though you can't speak, but coming here alone would be super scary. Let's see. Oh man. Look at this huge dragon they have. So thousands of tourists would have come here during the 90s and visited this place. Oh, look there. Shit, nearly fell through the fucking... Nearly fell through the fucking floor. Bloody hell, nearly fell down. This floor is like loose. I'll stick to the... I'll stick to that side. Dragon. Huge dragon with a girl at the top. And slay the, slay the dragon like David and Goliath kind of style. What's this? Look at this lady. She's, she even has pubes. <laughs> and she has boobs as well, with nipples on, and horns. Oh, she's a fish lady. So she's like a, a mermaid. Comes out the fish with pubes and boobs and horns. I don't know who's into that. Not me. <laughs> right. I think we've reached the we've reached a door. What's this? Should we try to open it? Have a look. Let's try to open this door. No luck. Whoa, fucking hell, look at this. Huge mask. What's behind him? Nothing, just a wall. How are you here, man? Hey. Let's keep moving forward. Wow, look at these people, look at his face. His eyes are fucking scary. Oh man, so scary. The paint. Oh my god, this one looks like his eyes move. These are really well painted. And they look super scary. Doing the face test, see if any of them move. All these statues, they all tell a story. Wow. It's just on the lap of this cave. Oh man. It's the one we saw at the beginning. But all these that eyes. Still painted on. Oh my god, that's so scary. I've seen the scariest one. This is fucking Red Demon here. That looks super scary. Oh, I've got fruit and stuff left for them. But oh man, look at this guy. Women. Wow. I did not expect we'll stumble onto this this evening. But look where we are. Got who a man on this journey with me. Don't know if you can see him there. 
This is really the abandoned mythical caves. I walked through miles and miles of tunnel to find these abandoned figurines. Wow. This is for a man. Future. So now me and Herman have to make our way back out the tunnel. I'm sure we can find our way back. I'll get back to you guys once we're further down. It's going to be a long walk. Guys, we've done it. Completed the mythical caves. Her man having a well deserved drink. Let's get out of here. Yeah, this was just in an abandoned car park. It's about nearly midnight. We made it out, guys. Everywhere's closed. Wow. Everyone's asleep. Everything's done. Maybe I'll just go get, grab some food in this 7 Eleven. Yeah. Good man. Just here. Oh, uh. Oh man, so this is Herman. We've done it. I don't know if you can see us, but we've completed the mythical caves. Who knows how we can top this? I really don't know. This is kind of peak content. And yeah, guys, we'll see you for the next one. Peace.